up YouTube, this is Unicorn Attack for Total War Addict. Um, we're, uh, ho I'm hosting a beta combo tournament. Uh, it's a mixed uh, avatar tournament and I'm joined here with Mayutsu. Yo. Stop me. Mayutsu. Mayutsu also has his own channel. Uh, you should definitely check it out. It will be in the description box. And uh, But let's go back to the battle. This is the final between Point Man and Seventh and Seven Son Sprint, Sprint. right? Yep. Sprint. Yeah, the point Man is from the Seattle Steel. Sorry? The map's crossroads. Yeah. Thanks. And can you say the army composition of uh, Point Man? Because we're watching from yep. Point Man's perspective. Uh, he has on the front two spear levies. Uh, behind that, some Black Tortoise Force. Yarikachi beside the our main army and Shogitai. Three Shogitai, yes. And some uh, of the upgraded yeah. Yariki and Shogunate Guard Cav. So, pretty typical army for this map, I think. A bit range component with some low level Black Torch Force and Shogitai, so he's gonna rush it. Yeah, but I why is he like. Um, just he's so wide. Uh, deployment, you know, you can, he has some units over on the right side for the shrine, and he, he really wants to have all the dojos. I think he should have when you have a melee uh, attack yeah, on this map, you should focus on one point, right? When you're gonna or rush it, I would I must make it a bit stupid. more compact, yeah. Yeah, but, but seeing as the shrine is on the right and Archido is on the left, I think he doesn't want to give up on any one of those. Okay, let's see Seven Sun Sprint's army. He has some better lines, definitely. With a United States Marine, extra range. A white bear with extra range and some Imperial Infantry. And in the back he has Yari Kachi, surprising. Yari Kachi? Yeah. How many? One. One, uh, one. Three. Three, three of them. Levy. Yeah, three. And he has some uh, yeah. decently upgraded Yari Ki. Oh, uh, Shogun's Guard. Cavalry. Uh, Those two are pretty guard good. Cav, Yari Ki. Yari, Yari Ki are level two. Right, I two more Yari Ki. So that's fine. It will win the rules because three max the same. Yep. And looking at point man, he's now a bit skirmishing with his Shogun Guard. Well, he's uh, luring the Shogun Guard cavalry out for the uh, Yari Ki sprint, but he sprint is capturing the shrine as well as the archery dojo. And I think with these 150 range white bear in the middle, uh, sprint can really do some. Uh, heavily yeah. damaged the uh, spear levy of point man. Point man is uh, charging one of the Yariki but falls back because of the uh, melee general of uh, Sprint. He's trying to support. But I don't know if the 150 range is really useful here because considering the map they don't have a lot of visibility. And that's true but it depends on um, well if Point man has to run over like he's doing now. He has some cover by these small hills, yes. but if he wants to charge in his 150 range units, like uh, Sprint is not doing it, he ha he puts them a bit more to the right side, and he has a clear line of sight right now when you zoom in at the unit. Yeah, I don't really know why Near the are archery not there's a clear line of sight. Some... Ah, he can shoot. Ah, yeah, it's the archery dojo. Now I see. But I definitely could see that he could shoot some units, but maybe it's not in range or something. In, I can't see the range of uh, sprints, but I would say they're not in range, just barely. Barely, yeah, I think also, yeah, my mistake. Point man is but slowly crawling towards the line. Oh, nice volley by the oh. United States Marines on the Yarikachi. Yes, very good chain volley over there. And looking at the left side, Pointman is now getting the uh, shrine. And the Shogunate Guard um, Cav, Pointman is now charging into general. the Yariki off guard. Nice. He's no, going for the general. general. No, he decided to go on the Yariki. Yeah, yeah. I, he should have He should have continued that. But I, I think the Shogunate Guard Cav will be wasted because of the Damn rare charge of the Yariki also. And on left flank, left, but Pointman is going yeah, yeah, all in. He's going all there's in. There's now a nice charge of sprint into the Black Tutors Force and the Black Tutors Force of Point Man that is over on the uh, farmhouse's side. A lot of wavering already. Yarikachi and a Yariki from Point Man is wavering. Yeah, I think sprint that's is the counter why charging. He's so spread out, but looking at the center, he's doing a great job uh, with his melee force. 
with these Yeri Katya Sprint are really holding strong over there. They're really holding the Shogun. They can really hold the Shogun for a long time that the right bear and Phantom can do something. But there's common calf charge on the right side by the wind 150 range of the right bear of Sprint. But uh, the right the right side of Sprint is holding pretty strong over here. General is under attack. I would say that it's not clear who's gonna win, but I think Point Man has a, a shot. Even though he's outranged. Yeah, that's that's true. Yeah, I he think he's going all the to first bullish came from um, sprint, but um, looking at the power bar, it's still 50-50. And new and uh, since these uh, shogun are now in melee, I wouldn't wouldn't say that sp uh, sprint point uh, is has very the game. risky. I think point man is doing good job right yeah. now, but he, he's taking a huge risk with his general. That's true, but sprint isn't targeting the general. No, and I think he should. But it's a melee chance, so this, uh, he will be is. the last man standing. And I think he uses Banzai, so he will have an unbreakable moral. And there comes the new positioning of the Imperial Infantry, so Pointman really should have be gone right now with his general. Uh, the general, yeah, is a can snipe. There goes the general. So the United States Marines routed. The game. white bears are wavering, yeah. and a lot of care from the Sprint is wavering. Your men are running, sir. And Pointman still has a, a decent lead. Uh, full Shogi Tai. No, this, this point man has this. Definitely now. Yeah, yeah. Good game, by the way. Yeah, uh, very nice version. Sprint did okay, but I, um, I agree of on now. the uh, army composition of point man more just because of his melee force he had used in this map. I think this map is the Definitely. best way to use melee, especially when you attack in the middle. The only great skirmish fight you can have is over on the on the shrine side, you know? Yes, in the shrine down, that there's a lot of flat yeah. terrain. Yeah. Uh, on top, there is a bit of space Look, near the archery where you can shoot. Standing. But oh, there it go. I wouldn't have taken the, those 150 the range units. Maybe one. Uh, he had two of them. And yeah, the Yari aren't really effective in holding a Shogatai charge. That's true, but they can hold because they were upgraded for. Four Sir Chevron? Four Chevron, I think. Yeah, yeah four. So they can hold for pretty long, long time, but... Yeah, um, I think the armor composition of Point Man was just better, yeah, even better. though he lost his whole right side, and his left side, his charge was okay, but... Mm. He charged at the right he moment, was. when on the right flank, Sprint was uh, busy with microing his calf and his general, and yeah, he, he went all in. he did a really great job there. He yes. went all in, and, and it worked. Yeah. So yeah, you did a very uh, good job there, and I also like you said in the beginning of the game that the hills have some protection for his units, and the Black Tooth Force, looking at the stats of the units right now, did their purpose to kill. Um, yeah. They really did a good job over there, and they're for only Black Tooth Force. Black Tooth Force, yes. Well, well, that's it. When you all those uh, line infantry, enemy line infantry, up with Shogi Tai or other units, those Black Tooth Force can make the difference. Normally, they they wouldn't. Um, yeah, make a dent in another line infantry unit, but when firing from the back, they really are useful. Well, congratulations, uh, Point Man, and he has won this uh, tournament. Yeah, congrats, man. You win the Beta Color Tournament 6 Mixed Avatar. Uh, you will be known as one of the best general. Uh, blah, 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 blah. You know. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Miyusu, for uh, co casting this with me. Yes. Um, thank you. All the for viewers. Hosting. Sorry? Thank you for hosting. Yeah, no problem. Um, for the viewers, uh, please rate, comment, subscribe, and really check out my YouTube, his own YouTube channel. It's in the description box. Um, thank you for watching. Okay, bye bye.